50th anniversary of, of the founding of, of hip hop. We've asked our, our artists to be inspired by what hip hop means to them. This vibrant series by Florida artist Chris Clark is both colorful and entertaining with a focus on hair. He has this way in which he, he really likes to focus on little kids with dreads. Another piece by South Florida artist and architect Brandon Clark goes straight to the lyrics. This is a hip hop, a very famous hip hop lyric by the great Biggie Smalls, uh -huh. Christopher Wallace. Uh -huh. So what Brandon did was he encapsulated many of the lyrics of that inside of this piece. In this section, local DJ Fly Guy presents photographs of other famous hip-hop DJs, while across the aisle, George Clinton, a pioneer of funk music, showcases a series of paintings for sale. He's one of the most sampled uh, artists uh, uh, in hip-hop, you know, and so he is also a painter, and we're happy to be showcasing some of his work. Christopher guides us through a historic collection inside the historic Ward Rooming House, presenting a not-for-sale exhibit titled For the People, 700 the Arts, featuring African-American art from the Miami-Dade Public Library collection. And so it has a, an incredible art collection, and particularly has a very strong collection of African-American original art. The exhibit is filled with works by recognized black artists in history. This is actually a print uh, done by the great Jacob Lawrence, uh -huh. and it's a series of prints that that tell the story and life of Toussaint Laventure. Piece after piece in this exhibit has a connection to the community and black arts culture, and Christopher credits the Miami-Dade Public Library for making it accessible to all. These are not just random things that they picked up at, you know, Walmart. Mm -hmm. Like, these are actually real works of art. Now this Art Beat exhibition is getting started. The party you can see, the Point Comfort Art Fair and Show is on and on and on in Overtown now through Sunday. Come and check it out as we see art everywhere coming off of the train. So much more. Back to you guys in the studio. Wow. Just ex exquisite stuff as you always. You can buy some art, hop on the train, okay. and take it to your friends in Orlando. Get on the train. <laughs> Lisa, thank you very much. And Art Week is kicking into high gear, and CBS News Miami has your ticket to all the big events. Tomorrow we'll take a look at the art everywhere across South Florida that you and your family can explore.